Hey guys, we are live. Sorry about that. Uh, what's up? What is going on out there today? Happy Monday. Uh, look, hope you're having a great start to your day wherever you are. And uh, maybe got some tennis on tap today or maybe something in the gym or maybe some other kind of cross training that might be great for your tennis. Um, I'm still working on that piece of property down south here at Steamboat Springs, Colorado. Oak Creek, we got about six acres down there and still doing some clearing, a little chainsaw activity, not the big, not the big gas powered chainsaw, more the little battery powered one, but uh, gets the job done and then stacking logs and all that good stuff. So, uh, but I do have uh, some tennis on tap for tomorrow. Looking forward to that. A good workout over at the Steamboat Tennis Center. So guys, let's get to it today. And what I've got for you is um, tomorrow. Uh, Tuesday, which is going to be the 28th of uh, September, 7 a.m. Uh, Pacific. Um, we're going to do a live show with my really good friend and incredible tennis mind, Jim McLennan. And of course, I've got the wrong picture up there. Hold on. Dang it, because I'm, I'm, I'm misspelling it. Hold on. I don't want to do that. That's not right. Uh... Where are we? Here we go. That's the one I want. And let's bring this back and give Mr. McLennan the, the due that he deserves, which is to make sure that his, <laughs> there, that his name is actually spelled correctly. Sorry about that, Mac. Anyway, um, one of my all-time favorite guys in the world of tennis and, you know, on and off the court, uh, a real character, smart guy. Um, but you know, for me, the guy who is, is probably right now, the one person that I would go to, um, and that I've done this in the past, that if there's something that comes up for me about Tom Stowe that I didn't really quite get back in the day, and that maybe I'm still, you know, sort of struggling to figure out, well, what did Tom mean when he said blank, you know, fill in the blank, I'm going to go to Jim McClellan. And uh, the reason for that is just that Mac has got a unique, a unique insight into the game of tennis. And um, so, look, if you've never heard of Jim McLennan, um, he's one of the original tennis instructional website guys way back in the day, like 1998, 1999 with Tennis One. They were one of the first. I was sort of right on their heels with web tennis. But, um, you know, Mac had a big, a big influence uh, on, on Tennis One back, at, back in the late 90s. So he's been doing the online thing um, ever since, <laughs> ever since it started, really. And if you don't know him, I want you to go check him out before um, my interview with him tomorrow. Again, uh, Tuesday, September 28th, 7 a.m. Pacific Live. Go over to Essential Tennis Instruction, all spelled out one word essentialtennisinstruction.com and uh, and just kind of poke around and uh, you'll get an idea of what the great Jim McLennan is all about. Um, he's actually going to flip the script on us tomorrow where he's going to be asking me some questions. And look, it's one thing to be able to ask a guy like Jim McLennan a question and get just a really thought provoking answer but it's another thing for someone else like him to be able to come along and, and flip it. And, you know, where, where he's asking the questions and not, not only is he great with the questions he asks, but once you start to give an answer, it kind of triggers something in that, in that noggin of his, which goes a little bit deeper and just, you know, let me kind of give you just a quick little thing of what he's, uh, looking for tomorrow for me. He's going to ask me, he says, what are your challenges and projects as a player? What are your challenges and projects as a teacher? Can you describe your problem solving skills in a match? That's huge, right? Can you describe your problem solving skills in a match? Old school versus the modern game. When or what are your thoughts and how, um, and how does the influence, if not speak to you, to your or online audience. I'm not sure what that one is. I'm sure he'll clean that up for us tomorrow. If players change and evolve the game of tennis, is the same true teachers? 
Are they following the players or taking the game in a new direction on their own? Has he, how, how has the internet changed the face of tennis teaching? So, you know, I'm sure that's in, look, I, I think we're, we're planning on a good solid 30 minutes. So, you know, carve out tomorrow, 7 a.m. Pacific. Join us, bring your questions, right? YouTube uh, live, Facebook live, and, um, uh, you know, we'll be able to answer your questions as well. Um, so that's really about it for me today, guys. I uh, just want to make an announcement of what I am really looking forward to uh, tomorrow uh, with Jim. Always love spending time with this guy. And, you know, if you spend any time with him or maybe seeing him on video, you know that the sense of humor is about as dry as it gets. Um I just love being around this guy. So, guys, that's it for me today. We're only at, what, six minutes right here. Uh, mark your calendar for tomorrow, Tuesday, September 28th, 7 a.m. Pacific. Um, join us live, YouTube and or Facebook, or Facebook. And in the meantime, if you're not familiar with Jim, go on over to EssentialTennisInstruction.com. Check it out. And um, look, I'll look forward to seeing you guys tomorrow. I'll put a, an, an announcement out there uh, sometime either later today to my email list or first thing in the morning uh, tomorrow so that um, you know where to join us. All right, guys, as always, any questions, any remarks, any comments down below in the comments area, you can do it there. You can also shoot me an email, brent at webtennis.com. And uh, hey, look, if you're if you're struggling with any part of your game right now, a specific part, could be technique, could be tactics, could be mental, could be physical. Maybe the experiences once you're on the court playing a match. One of the things we're going to talk about tomorrow with Jim is how do you problem solve, right? How do you do that? And um, so if there's anything you want to work on uh, with me, private one-on-one, -on -one, we can either do video of you. We can do a side-by-side -side comparison with you and me in terms of technique uh, and see what the differences are. Maybe, you know, probably minor, maybe a little bit more than minor. Uh, we'll take a look at that, or we can just chat, whatever is your preference. If you're interested in that, some one-on-one -on -one coaching, typically it's a 30-minute session, just one one time. And if, if you absolutely love it and you get something out of it, then up to you. We can go ahead and schedule a, a second time. Uh, but just shoot me an email. Let me know if you're interested in getting more details um, about the format and the price over at Brent at webtennis.com. All right, guys, it's time. Let's all get out there. Help another human. Have a spectacular day. Guys, join me and Mac tomorrow morning, uh, Tuesday, September 28th, 7 a.m. Pacific, live. And uh, we'll see you.